Today, websites like BirdaStyle provide access to thousands of sewing patterns. These patterns describe the cutting, folding, and stitching required to physically fabricate clothing. But garment designers for virtual characters do not exploit this data. Instead, they use special purpose garment modeling and sculpting tools. These tools often require significant expertise and can be very time consuming to use. We present techniques for automatically parsing sewing patterns into 3D garment models. Our parser first extracts the panels and styling elements that comprise a sewing pattern. Starting from the pattern PDF, we run a connected component analysis to identify the panels. We then extract all text labels and corner match circles. We assign the labels to interior lines and panel contours. We split the panel contour and interior lines into stitching edges at sharp corners. Finally, to extract the styling elements, we analyze the interior lines and labels. Our parser next identifies the correspondences between stitching edges to determine how the panels assemble into a garment. The correspondence identifier first processes stitching edges on the main body panel and then considers decorative panels. For each set of edges, the identifier builds a table of probabilities where each entry captures the likelihood of a correspondence between a pair of stitching edges. We then apply integer programming to find the optimal set of correspondences between stitching edges. More details on these two steps are in the paper. Here we color code corresponding stitching edges. Note that the pattern PDFs only include the left side panels of garments, and we duplicate and reflect each panel to form the right side. After parsing the pattern, we use a garment simulator to generate the corresponding 3D model and drape it on a virtual mannequin. Our simulator extends the sensitive couture system of Umetani et al. to support a large variety of real-world sewing patterns. We have parsed a variety of women's dresses from the Berta Style pattern collection. Many of these garments contain styling elements and decorative panels. This dress contains separate pleat panels between the main skirt panels. This pattern has very short sleeves and a belt holds the garment close to the body. This sweatshirt includes a hood and two front pockets. This dress has two layers, one in red and one in white. This garment includes shorts that are attached to the top and a separate belt. We tested 50 patterns and our system correctly parsed 34 of them. For the other 16, there were an average of 4.3 errors. In most of these cases, we could use the interactive editing tools in Sensitive Couture to quickly correct the problem. Here we remove a correspondence that incorrectly stitched the front of a jacket together. We have developed two applications that take advantage of our collection of parched sewing patterns. Our sketch-based search application lets users draw a panel and specify its name to find similarly shaped panels across the pattern collection. Our garment hybrids application lets users smoothly interpolate between two input patterns. Here, the neckline changes and the pleats in the sleeves and body of the dress disappear. Users can also interpolate subsets of panels. Here we interpolate just the front, back, and collar panels. Here we interpolate just the sleeves. We believe that automated parsing of sewing patterns can enable many more such data-driven applications.